Greetings, Vanguard community. You may be wondering where I am and why I'm here today. And I'll get to that in just a moment. But before I do, I just want to give a very special thanks to everybody who was able to make it to these September and October games. Whether you are a player or a staff member, um, from the bottom of my heart, I give you thanks. I had such a blast wrapping up the Vanguard 1.0 experience. Uh, you brought your creativity, you brought your spirit, you brought your heart, you brought your role play. And so on behalf of the Vanguard board, I thank you. But Vanguard's not over. And I know a lot of you have been wondering, what is Vanguard 2.0 going to look like? You've had many questions. And we've had some answers. The board has been hard at work getting Vanguard 2.0 set up. We've had to keep some of these answers close to our chest, admittedly. But now we are in a position where we can start unveiling some of the secrecy of Vanguard 2.0. You may have questions about the lore. You may have questions about the rules. And those answers will be coming your way. But today, I am here to unveil a secret that we have been keeping very close to our chest. No more. Today, you will learn about the new home of Vanguard. So without further ado, I would like to introduce you to Camp McNeil. Welcome to the new frontier. So you might be wondering what you're looking at. These wooden gates are the fortified walls of the new settlement that the players of the Vanguard 2.0 experience will be residing in. If you look around at this place, this place looks like such a wonderful frontier town. We've got these walled in wooden gates, barracks at both sides, a back gate, and a common area. And oh, stairs? There are stairs? What are they? Why are there stairs? Take a look at that. For all you boomer users, all of our ranged combatants, we have an actual guard post. Say there's an invasion. Say zombies are at the gates. Say bandits are rolling into town. You can take your range users, have them go up to the guard post, and they can fire safely down at the enemy as it's coming in through the gates. We even have guard towers. Guys, it is hard for me to contain my excitement. This place is so cool. Like, you're getting to see the video version. I'm getting to walk through the real life version. This is going to be amazing. The immersive play spaces we're going to have for the feeling of our frontier town. This is going to be absolutely fantastic. This area is but one of many areas that make this place perfect for our 2.0 game. And now, I'm about to show you one of the coolest assets of the Camp McNeil experience. As any good crafter knows, you need materials to be able to make armor, and items that your friends can benefit from. In the past, you've been able to gather these resources by looting them off of the corpses of your enemies. 
But today, we have a more immersive alternative. So without further ado, I would like to introduce you to Ye Ol' Mineshaft, where you can come, engage in missions, to find ores, source, rare materials. What's that? Is that a ladder? All right, let's go down. And this is the part of the video where we hope really hardly that Nick is able to maintain his balance with the camera while he descends through this ladder and whoop, into darkness. Your eyes don't deceive you. It is very dark down here. We are inside of a mine shaft. I'm gonna push forward a little bit down the tunnel. And as I'm moving, with hope, eventually some light will illuminate and you will see exactly what I see. Ah, here we are. Look at that. An actual mine shaft tunnel. It's still a little too dark to see that other part. Let's move a little bit forward. Now, you have to be very careful when you're down here. Make sure that you crouch so that you don't hit your head. Huh. To the left, look at that. Freedom. Back out into the open world. And to the right, further exploration. Who knows what could be found over there? A lump pile of source? A rare vein of mithril, atomite, all things for you to discover in the Vanguard 2.0 experience. Now, as part of the Vanguard 2.0 experience, you're going to be pioneers who have sailed to a new island, a new land. Maybe you're seeking riches. Maybe you're seeking discovery. Maybe you're just trying to get away from a home environment that was not ideal. Whatever the case, you will have made your way across the water, which means that we are on an island settlement. And if there's an island settlement, well, don't there need to be ships? Boom. Look at that. Our very own Vanguard 2.0 explorable, playable pirate ship. Take a look at this. We can actually get on the deck. There's stairs. If I knew more about pirate jargon, I would probably be calling this, I don't know, the or the poop deck, I don't know, but you get the idea. Take a look at all of this. You can actually move around this pirate ship. Completely immersive. If we take a look over the side, there's actual water. There's a nice wall here to keep us safe, so if we were to say, I don't know, get into fights with pirate, bandit, invaders, raiders, whatever you want to call them, we wouldn't have to worry about getting knocked overboard. We would smack right safely into the guardrail. Look at this. Of course, what is a pirate ship without a good mast? Folks, I am so excited. I think about all of the adventures that we can have here on our very own Vanguard 2.0 pirate ship. Just look at that and tell me that you don't get excited. So there you have it, Vanguard Faithful. Um, that was just a sample set of some of the many highlights that Cam McNeil has to offer for the Vanguard 2.0 experience. There are several other things that I could go into detail about, from these luscious, flat, open fields, which there are several of, um, to the fact that you know, getting from one place to the next 
is so much easier than it has been in the past. Uh, when you're not trying to fight up the side of a mountain, it just makes the experience completely different. We have all these wonderful, immersive, in-play areas that we can explore. We have a fort, we have barracks, we have guard towers, we have a source mine, we have a pirate ship. We have this area that's probably going to be used for several field battles. Look at that. Look behind me. This is like legitimately the size of an actual football field. This is incredible. I am so excited for the next era of Vanguard. And I hope, my only hope, is that you've been able to feel some of the excitement that I feel. That you are pumped. And I know that you're pumped. You're an incredible community. We love you. So everybody, welcome to the new frontier.